Ah. Good afternoon, Foundation staff. This is level 4 researcher Theron Sherman. And if you're watching this briefing, it's because you got lucky and get to supervise one of our very, very good boys. Item number, SCP-5430. Object class, safe. Special containment procedures. SCP-5430 currently inhabits the grounds of Area 12 and has been given an electric fence collar and implanted with three subdermal trackers to ensure that it remains within the perimeter of the area. The anomaly's non-hostile demeanor means that it may otherwise be left alone outside its bi-monthly medical checkup. Because its feet are intended for dry, sandy terrain, they ought to be measured once every two months so that protective footwear can be manufactured and fitted on it. Description SCP-5430 is a male Eastern God of Snake, genus Thamnophis Cetalis Cetalis, approximately 6.7 meters long, that has had 48 legs from an Eastern Blue Tongue Lizard, genus Teliqua Skinoides Skinoides? Thomically grafted onto it. Its length and legs are its only anomalous attributes. Aside from its predilection to use these legs for locomotion and increased appetite, the anomaly behaves like a non-anomalous male Eastern God of Snake. SCP-5430 was discovered in New York City Central Park on <laughs> following reports of hysteria in the park and sightings of a massive centipede-like lizard in the area. Mobile Task Force Lambda-12, codenamed Pest Control, were dispatched to contain it. The anomaly was found pursuing rabbits on the western side of the park and restrained with minimal difficulty. During containment of SCP-5430, Lambda-12 were accosted by one Jared McBraddock, an unlicensed, untrained thaumaturge that attempted to control the anomaly and have it attack the task force. SCP-5430 ignored Braddock and chose to walk laps around the pond after chasing and eating several rabbits. McBraddock was overpowered and brought into custody. A background check revealed that McBraddock had been arrested and released on bail one week previously for attempting to break into the Central Park Zoo's Tropic Zone. In addition, interrogation of McBraddock and a search of his residence revealed that he had been mutating commercial pet snakes with legs, fitting them with miniature bootleg sneakers, and selling them for at least one year prior to his capture. The apartment was thus confiscated by the Foundation, and McBraddock was given Class A amnestics and released. At this time, Mobile Task Force Alpha 4, codenamed Pony Express, is reviewing his records to locate all such mutated specimens. Addendum. During its most recent checkup, SCP-5430 was observed to respond positively to the attending physician's music player, undulating and moving its legs in a manner recognizable as dance. Loudspeakers have been set up near its current nesting site, a pond in the corner of Area 12, to play pop music at low volume during its basking hours. And, on a personal note, the lead researcher has let us know that our Snake Boy's favorite song is Break My Stride. <laughs> Simply adorable. Now, all right, staff, that ends our broadcast. Use your foundation encrypted YouTube account to like, comment, and subscribe, hit the bell, and support our broadcast at patreon.com site 42.